happy Sunday you guys welcome back to my channel my name is Chrissy Marie and today I'm going to be speed cleaning my kitchen and my dining room area it is an open concept living area and I have a whole bunch of crap to do today so I need to hurry up and get these two areas clean so I can function better and get through on the rest of our day both of the girls are getting shots today and we're supposed to be going to the pumpkin patch so I'm going to go ahead and jump right into it as you will see throughout this video I look like a complete hot mess express and I am unshowered my hair's not washed I have no makeup on the whole area over here is just a mess so again thank you so much for returning if you're new please subscribe so we can get you some more content out thank you so much and I hope you like this video thanks I look like a hot mess express. You can catch me any given day of the week at Walmart or Costco or Winco looking like this. I get mistaken for a bum half of the time, just to let you know. So I'm getting started by loading up the dishwasher. for them I gave them a couple of snacks but you will see them making a few cameo appearances throughout the video mom life I had just got my nails done and I did not want them to break fade or chip so I am putting on my kitchen gloves I bought them a few weeks ago you will see them in my under the kitchen sink organization video and this is the first time I'm actually wearing them voiceover I'm so tired because our day was so busy so I'm pretty much using all the same good old regular cleaning products that I always use in all of my other cleaning videos so if you want to know what any of them are pay attention to this video or go look at my other videos super stuck on them so I always have to soak them in the water. Does anybody else have that happen to them? And if you do, can you write in the comments what you use exactly to prevent the food from sticking on them? Even if they are in the sink overnight, sometimes that happens. We cannot get to our um, dishes immediately after the kids eat on them. But they'll get so stuck, like little pieces of cereal or oatmeal, super, super stuck, and it's so annoying. Look how cute under my kitchen sink is. Still, I can't even believe it's still super organized underneath there. I did a really cute, relaxing, and enjoyable clean under the kitchen sink with me, and we organized everything and put everything in cute little jars. That is on my... Um, 
my YouTube channel. So if you want to watch that, go watch it. It's really cute and good. If you're wondering what I was doing with my garbage can besides cleaning it, I had to soak it overnight because every other day when I go and get my Italian soda from the coffee stand down the street, the coffee workers, they're so adorable. They always give the girls these two little suckers for both of them and there was one stuck and wet and really icky and gooey and it had hardened at the very bottom like I think Shukri had thrown it down there when there wasn't a liner in it so it was a perfect opportunity for me to soak it and clean it with Clorox wipes. <laughs> helper she got bored watching her cartoons and eating her snacks so she wanted to come and bother mommy <laughs> just joking she um helped me take a couple of the toys that were in the kitchen and take them to her toy room <laughs> hard plastic liner of the inside of the garbage can was soaking overnight because there was the sucker at the bottom of it. I just took a normal garbage bag and kind of forced it inside and around the metal part of the garbage can and it got stuck up in there pretty good so lesson learned never do that again. I will completely 100% just take a garbage bag Set it on the counter and fill it up while I'm cleaning the shell of the garbage can. It looks like it didn't even get stuck, but I had to edit out like five minutes of footage because that baby was stuck in there good. <laughs> I mean, it was stuck stuck. I legit almost beat up the garbage can trying to get it out.
Swiffer Wet Jet. I am so sick and tired of it. I said it in the past few cleaning videos. I really, really, really need to find a new mopping system. I think I'm just going to go ahead and go with the Cedar Spin Mop. I've heard nothing but good things and seen nothing but good things about it. So I think I just need to take the plunge and get it. Okay, you guys, it's all done. It feels so good to and be in a nice clean area. Hi, baby Leila. Thank you so much for watching and following along with us. We will see you guys in the next one.